Hello all, Oni in the garden again, doing the front yard first this time. So this pepper here, doing okay. That pepper there, less so, but still alive, which is a good start. The bush beans are moving along. They look a little bit uh, deprived, so that's not great. This pepper here is doing pretty well. Especially considering that for the last two nights, uh, three really, we've had to cover the front garden with, uh, well, old sheets. Uh, temperatures got down into the low 40s for a couple of nights there, so it was not pleasant. And we didn't want to lose the tomatoes. So. Tomato itself doing pretty well. The cage decided to snap its mooring lines, so I've done something to try and hold those in place better. But those broke just completely. The uh, mustard greens doing quite nicely. The lettuces are both deciding to bolt. I've got some other stuff growing in there too I don't want or don't need. But uh, this patch over here is for the wife and she has decided that there's going to be uh, Napa cabbages and possibly some radishes in that area. I think we'll do Napa cabbages over on this side and the radishes over on this side. Just kind of that nice broad spot there. So that's pretty much it for the front yard other than the stoop, or the, the uh, verge. I definitely need to get in here and do some more weeding. But, that's a project for later this afternoon. On to the back. Okay. Now for the backyard. Pulled out a lot of the old the tree growings, the, the saplings that were over here. Uh, didn't want them anyways, don't need them, can't use them. So that's fine. Uh, lemongrass, the bush bean, uh, went inside the shed on the coldest of the nights. Came back out in the next mornings, so that was okay. Aloe, being aloe, I'm moving along, okay. The uh, bok choy looks like it's pretty well dead. It might decide to survive with just that leaf, but it's probably dead. Carrots, well, other than the one the child just pulled up, <laughs> doing okay. Be kind to the plant. And this little candle up here, not really doing much. Leave them alone, don't touch. Come on. Got this going right here. It is basically a box full of the uh, stuff we pulled up out of the lawn for the verge, plus all those uh, branches that I just cut for the saplings. So it's going to be kind of composting down over time, not as junk laden, uh, kitchen scraps and such uh, laden as the other compost pile, but or compost box but it is there. And that's pretty much it. There's not a whole lot going on. I'm not going to show you the compost bucket because it is scary. But uh, we've got some seriously autumnal weather that has just moved in and it's uh, going to be getting a little bit cooler so we'll have to put cooler weather plants in. So. We will uh, see you guys next time. Bye.